it's Tiffany. I am here with the new Twisty Pet Treats. I have the orange pandas and the watermelon puppies and the hamburger bear here. There are a few different other different ones to collect as well. I'm really excited for this series of Twisty Pets because I love food themed toys. <laughs> anyway, Twisty Pets, we make a bracelet and make a figure all in the same one so you can see right here this will make a bracelet and then it turns into this here and it's very easy to do this is series number four of twisty pets which is crazy and they are apparently scented so here you can see the whole collection there's rainbow jelly pups hamburger bears orange pandas sushi pandas swiss roll kittens watermelon puppies ice cream sandwich kittens donut bear uh, pancake bear and strawberry kitties. Oh, I didn't see the strawberry kitties one. That one would be really cute. So one, we pull the head and the tail. Two, we hook it together and make a bracelet. Ta-da! So I'm ready to get these open. I don't want to take them out of the boxes though. They're so cool. It looks so pretty in the boxes. But let's just go ahead and do it. So here is our very first one. We do get a little guide. Oh, and a checklist. So this is our little guide to help put it together and whatnot. Feel free to pause the video if you guys need the instructions. Um, and then this here is, I guess, a checklist. I don't know if it's all the series or what it is here. Okay, oh, here are the Twisty Pets babies, the Twisty Pets treats. Then we have, oh, the Elephant Family, Mer Kitty Family, Neon Unicorn Family, the Yorkie Family, the Blings. We have the Cuddles. Oh, I never unboxed any of these. They're really, really cute looking. And then we have the gems. Oh, we have lots of different, lots of different things on this checklist here. Oh my gosh, look at those. Those are pretty. Anyway, <laughs> let's go ahead and pop this candy bear set out. And let's check this out. I'm going to grab the instructions just in case I need them. So we're going to just go ahead and pull these apart or not. Um, oh, there we go. We're starting to pull them apart. I don't know. I think I, I may have done it wrong. Yeah, <laughs> I did a little wrong, but you just go ahead and you pull them apart and then it makes this cool little bracelet. I think I got all the pieces apart. I like this one, it has the two little, this little piece has the two pandas. Those are really super cute, oh my goodness. Okay, and then we just go ahead and connect this into the panda's head like so. And then we have this cool orange bracelet. So you can see something different like on each one of these which is really awesome. This one again is my favorite. This one really doesn't have much going on, but then we have a panda there. Okay, so now if you don't want, and this is elastic so it'll fit right on your wrist. So next we're gonna go ahead and put everything back together, which should be very easy to do. So let's go ahead and I think this, sits, yep, this sits up there. This one sits here, this one sits here, this one sits here. Oh, I didn't really realize that was a car. Okay, anyway, this one sits here, and there we go. We have it all back together. Isn't that crazy how quickly that took to take apart and put back together? And let's go ahead and do the watermelon puppies next. I really like these. Watermelon is my favorite. Well, one of my favorite fruits. Um, I have a lot of favorite fruits, but my top so it's really exciting to have a bracelet version with poppies on it so this looks like it'll work pretty much the same as the panda one it's kind of the same shape so we're gonna go ahead and take it apart okay there we go I think this one this one should come apart here too yeah okay so first panel we have this dog on the bicycle with watermelon this one is really cool because the watermelon's translucent it has a little puppy there. Again, the watermelon's translucent here, which is awesome. I think the watermelon's translucent on pretty much all of these, and I like this one, the solid watermelon, and it's translucent. This is really fun, and I like the sides, how they have a watermelon pattern on them. This is just all so cool. <laughs> That's so awesome. And I like when it's put together. I guess I didn't really show you guys all that well, but let's take a look-see. So let's put this little guy back on top. So it has bites taken out of it right there on the side and we have little puppies hanging out the side actually. This is really cute. Oh my goodness. Alright, the last one we have is the burger. It seems like it's going to work the same. I think they might all pretty much work the same now that I'm really thinking about it. Let's go ahead and get this open. 
This one I thought would be my favorite though because of all of the fun different like ingredients I guess you could say. Um, but we have lots of bears hanging out everywhere and we have lots of ingredients so if we go ahead and take this apart. I'm actually curious to see what it looks like on the inside of some of these. So let's see what's between this bun and lettuce. I can't quite get that apart. It is a little bit I would say trickier I guess to get the, uh, the these ones to unstack. Maybe this doesn't come apart. This one might not. I think it does. I don't think it does. I don't know. I can't tell with this one. I don't think it does. Um, so we have this one, which is really cute. It's like a little thing of cheese or something there. This is just lettuce. This is just tomatoes with a bear on it. This one is the cheese and ketchup and onions with a little bear on it and then just the chopper here, which I don't think comes apart. But at the same time, I do think it does. It definitely does, doesn't it? I can't tell. <laughs> I'm gonna try to pry it apart a little bit. Oh, okay, it did, it did come apart. It's need a little assistance. So there's nothing really exciting, exciting hidden under there. So we'll just go ahead and put it back together. I'm gonna go ahead and put this bear back on the top. And we'll just put this all back together. It's really cute. I love it. I love it. It's so amazing. I love all of these little bracelets. But of all three, oh, let's put this, this little guy back on top. Maybe not. Are we? Are you not gonna sit up there, bud? Why does he want to sit up there? I don't know what's going on with this one right now. Okay, we'll just have him sit out in the air. <laughs> so of all three of these, I think my favorite definitely. I really, really did like the watermelon one. It surprised me a lot, but I mean, for overall looks when it's closed, I think the bear one is my favorite with the burger, but when it's open, the watermelon one is definitely my favorite because of all of the fun surprises and fun little scenes on each slice of watermelon. And I like the little doggies hanging out of the watermelon. So overall, I would say the watermelon ultimately is my favorite. But these were all so super cute. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.